is it Snekala and I'm back with another video. I literally have no boobs. <laughs> so, hello guys. Uh, sorry, obviously sorry I did not video. Last week I really had a busy week. Uh, I do still do. Um, I've had uh, deadlines. So, like a lot of deadlines. So. I just didn't have time to like fit in a video somewhere, uh, but here I am now with a life lesson. Ah! So, yeah, yeah. Anyway, so yeah, uh, I've had a lot of people message me uh, on different social media platforms lately, saying they uh, wish they were like me or wish they were like someone else or they're depressed or they're sad or they want to look better uh you know sort of all these things in the line like on along those lines um yeah so i decided to do something about it because um you know i've been helping people with anxiety uh depression suicide self-harm all those things um for a couple of years now um just because um, a lot of people come to me with those things. Um, I don't know why, I don't know how. I mean, like some people don't know me and they come to me with real problems, uh, which is amazing. Thank you so much. Um, if you do have any problems, please come to me after this video or any other time. Uh, I will help you with advice and stuff like that if you want. Uh, but anyway, so I. I've been helping people with those type of things for a long time and I just want to put it out there for everyone that some people that are scared to like come forward and be like I, I, I want a friend or I, I'm i sad you know what I mean um, I just want to tell you all guys that there's no point in being sad about someone um, everyone's beautiful and everyone's pretty a different way uh, yeah, I mean, I have flaws, everyone has flaws, Ariana Grande has flaws, or Selena Gomez and everyone else has flaws, and there's something that they don't like about themselves as well, like, you know, their nose or something like that, um, and they not, don't necessarily change it, or sometimes those things aren't, I don't have a way of being changed, if you get what I mean, um, so yeah, uh, I mean, yeah, you can't change everything and you're born the way you are, so you should be that way. Um, also, uh, people keep like messaging me, it's really distracting. <laughs> but that's usual, isn't it? So. But yeah, anyway, also another topic I wanted to say is uh, fuck boys and fuck girls. Um, a lot of people have been like coming to me with that as well. How to get over a boy and how to like, you know. Um, deal of people leaving and stuff like that. Um, basically, uh, if someone leaves, right, um, they're not worth you, like, they're not worth your time. Uh, you're an amazing person and you shouldn't, because someone leaves or because someone uses you and leaves for another person, another guy or another girl, um, doesn't mean that you're worse than them. Uh, sometimes it means that you're too good for them and they leave because you know you're stubborn or you're stubborn and you don't want to do some things that they want you to do but they go to someone that will do those things and one day they will realize they'll come back maybe not necessarily to you but they'll come back to the memory of you and they'll be like yeah I should have dated that person because I'd rather have a wife that is like this and was smart and nice and that's the way she loved me and she treated me than someone else that they decided to just go for because they were easier to get or they were easier to do things with that they wanted them to do um which is crazy um i don't get the whole concept of fuck boys and fuck girls uh this is still getting demonetized <laughs> but i don't get the concept of fuck boys and fuck girls like and I, I don't know. It's just weird. Um, I, I don't get it. Like, it's like you want a relationship, but you don't. I don't understand that. Like, 
you're basically in a relationship because you're doing things with people and you're like you like them and you talk to them all the time you kiss them you hang out you just you do this and that different people different things um yeah you don't date like or you don't tell your friends about them it's really weird i don't know i just don't get it like <laughs> I don't get it. It's like you're in a relationship, but you're never official. It's really weird. I don't, I don't understand it. Can someone explain it to me? Can someone like make a video back and explain it to me? Cause it's crazy. I don't know. It's weird. Um, yeah, I don't even know. I don't even know what I'm going to title this video. Um, it's just me ranting basically, but it's good. Um, I mean, it might make people think, um, I don't know. I don't think you should be a fuck girl or fuck boy. If you are, watching this and you're one of those people, um, I don't know, think twice I, before you do things because, yeah, think twice because you might hurt someone just because that's what you want and just because, yeah, that's a good one, just because um, the person agrees to do things with you or to be just a fuck girl or fuck boy with you uh, and they agree not to have a relationship doesn't mean they don't want one. Sometimes people say agree to things because they love someone or they really really like someone So they say to agree to the thing, but actually they don't want it um, They just do it because they want to spend time with the person and that's really sad um, You shouldn't do that. You shouldn't say or do things for people because you want to spend time with them if that person is worth your time and they want to be with you and they like you back, um, they will make sure to hang out with you. They'll make sure to uh, text you as well and they'll make sure to find time for you and stuff like that. Um, yeah, you don't have to, you're not, you shouldn't be doing things for them just to spend time with them. If they don't show that they want to spend time with you as much as you want to spend time with them, you should just move on. You should um, move on, find someone better. Um, find someone that actually, um, you know, cares, look at the life differently. Find someone that cares, find someone that always has time for you. Find someone that you call at night um, to go to the hospital and they will drive to your house and take you to a hospital and even wait in the waiting area with you because that's the type of people you should have in your life. <laughs> Um, no, but seriously, that's the type of people you should have in your life. People that just want things from you, you should just leave. Whether it's even boy or girl, the opposite sex, or whether it's just a friend, you shouldn't be doing things for people. Like, if they don't, like, say, um, if someone just <laughs> uses you all the time for, like, doing things, like, I don't know, because you're more popular and you have friends, so they use you to, like, meet people and meet guys and meet their boyfriends for you, and that's only why they're friends with you, and then when they get the boyfriend because because of you, like, because you help them get the relationship, they'll just leave, and they'll call you, like, unworthy and stuff like that, and, um, they'll just leave. That is just horrible. I don't know. Um, be careful, kids. That's, that's what I'm saying. Because so many people are fake, and you should realize who's not fake. Um, yeah, just, just be careful, man. Also, to like wrap out this video, I'm gonna talk about shaming people. Uh, you shouldn't shame people for what they wear as well. Um, a lot of people just tend to say someone's a fuck girl or a fuck boy. Or a slut, or a bitch, or a whore, or a man, or whatever. Uh, you get what I mean. Um, because of the way they wear, the way the dress, they dress. Uh, no, <laughs> sorry, that's not that's not the case. I mean, just because a girl wears a uh, a short skirt doesn't mean she's a slut, and just because a guy wears a pink hoodie, it doesn't mean he's gay. Or just because I don't know, he wears. A brand. Uh, this is a big thing. Just because someone wears a brand doesn't mean doesn't define them who they are. Um, I don't know. Say <laughs> I tend to wear um, what's it called? Uh, Ralph Lauren and Jack Quills a lot, and I have jackets and things from there. And it's like one one of my favorite shops and stuff. And a lot of people just put it up 
posh um, label on me, they think that I'm posh. <laughs> Doesn't necessarily mean that I'm posh. Some people wear um, clothes that are always like showing their stomach or showing their legs. Um, doesn't necessarily mean that they're a slut. Um, just because someone, some boy wears, um, yeah, there's a brand, there's a brand that's like marked as a f-boy f brand. I don't know why I said f-boy when I said fuck like 50 times in this video already. It's probably already demonetized, but like, f it. <laughs> um, but yeah, I don't know, there's another brand for boys that a lot of like guys, if they like wear that brand, that it means they're like fuck boys and stuff and this is crazy <laughs> so yeah um what this video was basically about was just me ranting um sorry probably doesn't make any sense but it had to get out there um i don't know i just want you guys to think twice before you do things because you may not think you're hurting someone but you might be hurting someone um also words hurt way more than you think even though words don't count as much as actions do but Words do hurt you, and sometimes words can get to you way more than actions can. So, yeah. Slap across the face isn't necessarily more sore than someone being called unworthy. Um, so, you need, to, you need to think before you speak. You need to think before you do things as well, because you may want something that someone doesn't want to, and they'll still say, yeah, but they actually don't want it, and then you'll hurt them, and... You know, it may it may lead to really bad things. Some things you do, or some things you say, may lead to really bad things, and it could possibly end someone's life, which is a really scary and bad thought. And no one should want to end their life because of other people or because of themselves. Because everyone's beautiful, everyone's pretty, and everyone's perfect in their own way. And I want you guys to know that because as cheesy as this is and as cheesy as everyone says this is, um, everyone is beautiful. They are. There's always some sort of good and some sort of amazing thing in everyone. Um, and you should find that thing and you should be happy and you should be confident and you should be confident with yourself. Um, every street is like a catwalk so you should be confident. Be yourself and believe in yourself and yeah so I hope you guys also remember that if anything does happen to you or someone says something and you feel bad or sad or whatever uh, you can always DM me all my social medias are down below you can always message me I will answer whether I answer the next day or in two days I will always answer and I'll be there for you um, uh, I can even help you with anxiety or depression or whatever um, I've done it before and it works. You just have to be positive. So, yeah, I love you guys so much and I really don't want any of you to be sad. This is the whole point out of YouTube. Uh, a lot of people ask me why I do YouTube actually. Um, and I'm going to be doing a Q&A in the summer which is going to answer that question more deeply but one of the main reasons why I do YouTube is because I want to make people happy and laugh. Um, just whenever they're sad, so, like, you know, um, I'm doing that for you guys. Yeah, I just hope everyone's happy watching this. Please don't be sad, and if you are, please message me, because I love you. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and subscribe! Click the link down below. Ne I'm probably gonna, I'm possibly gonna upload twice this week, uh, it depends how my deadlines go, um, probably twice, so today and another day, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, I mean, it was pretty much me just running and it was like so pointless and like it doesn't make sense, but like you got, we got all my messages, right, you got it, you, you, you got it, it's cool, I don't care, whatever, um, so, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you guys subscribe, like, whatever you want to do. Um, I mean, leave hate comments if you really need to, then I can just do another reacting to hate comments. That would be great. Oh my gosh, yes, leave hate comments down below. Good shit. Hey. Anyways, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys in my next video. 
and always remember you're beautiful. I love you guys. Bye.